What is this pink glob of goo washed up on a beach in Japan? That answer today on What the Fuck Is It Wednesday. Welcome back, Hoax Specter friends. This is Carrie, and this image crossed my cluttered desk with the claims that it was some mysterious piece of pink goo that washed up on the beach after the Japanese tsunami in 2011. But first, the question of the day. Do you believe there are giant sea monsters lurking below our water surface? Let me know what you think in the comments below. And now back to our image. My first thought was that SpongeBob finally got tired of Patrick Shet and forgot to add a weight to his smelly, rotting corpse. That would be kick-ass if it were true. The claim is that in 2011, after the tsunami, Tsunami hit Japan, a survivor filmed this huge creature that was washed up on shore along with other debris. While some use logic and suggested it might be a whale or giant squid, others who are prone to imagining things or otherwise not using logic or common sense pooped their pants and ran off into the sunset screaming, it's a globster. History is filled with globsters and blobsters going all the way back to 1648. A globster is a cryptozoological term. In other words, it's made up shit for people who wear tin hats. Globster, an unidentified organic mass that washes up on the shoreline of an ocean and just happens to not be Kim Kardashian's ass in a swimsuit. I think I speak for all those girls when I say one of the more infamous globsters is Trunko, which was purported to be the carcass of an animal that looked like a giant polar bear and fought two killer whales just off the coast of Margate, South Africa for three fucking hours. Even though the dead animal lay on the beach for 10 days, not one single scientist ever investigated it. And until September of 2010, it was believed that no photographic evidence existed of the creature. Upon investigating this image, I personally come to the conclusion that it was the world's largest dog known as the Commodore that happened to have dread and enjoyed reggae. So what really is this pink blob creature in the video? The answer to that question coming right up at first. Have you seen this footage of a UFO caught on film flying over Malaysia? Check back this Saturday and I'll let you know if it's a hoax or not. Not true, there was a tsunami in 2011 after magnitude 9.0 earthquake hit Japan. It's also been reported that over 5 million tons of wreckage that included homes, boats, cars, among other things, floated off into the ocean. Even though over 70% of it sank, that still left 1.5 million tons still floating about. So was this pink blob part of that debris? No. In fact, this footage is from 2010 and is known as the blob of Panda Express. Real name some shit I can't pronounce below. The blob was reportedly six meters in length and smelled like unwashed ass at a Burning Man festival. Most globsters and blobs usually end up being the remains of a whale, shark, or squid. In this case, it seems to have the shape and surface of a boulder or large rock. So yeah, it's one of those. A whale, shark, squid, or rock. Take your pick. I just love how people claim to find such badass shit and then not get science involved to find out what it is definitively. Okay, here are a couple more videos to keep you entertained until Saturday's UFO upload. That wraps up another edition of What the Fuck Is It Wednesday. Don't forget to hit that like button. I'm needy that way. And if you haven't already subscribed, you need to have yourself evaluated mentally. Peace out, motherfuckers.